Hello, today we will see how we can manage device software update using IMC. As you will see, it is very, very simple and quick to do this through IMC. Now let's go to IMC 7.2. So first thing to do is to add the software we want to deploy to the IMC software repository. So this is made under the service menu, configuration center, and you have here software library. So you will see all the software which I already added to my repository. So you can see some HP softwares. And if you want to add a new one, you have three options. First one, if you well, if you click on add, first one is to import the software either from your laptop or let me click on it or from a network device which is already deployed on your network which can be very interesting if you have a pre-production device and you test uh, the software so you can import then the software when it is uh, okay, tested and, and so on. Okay, second option is to add an OAP, OAP file. And last one I will do is to download the software from the web. So for HP devices, we can connect directly to live network, live update, and we can download the corresponding software corresponding to the device we have in our network. So let me click on next. You will see, so get update list. Yeah, I don't have any proxy here. So this takes a little while. And once it is done, you will see the list of all the available software for all the devices you have on your network. Okay, so you can see it takes some time, it takes a um, little bit long. So you can see some software from my 2920, okay. Okay, you can see the latest one here, and I think I have another, another device on my network. Yeah, an old, yeah, I have an old 2626, and here you can see the release corresponding, the latest release I can download from the web. So if you, you click on it, I already downloaded the latest release for my 2920, you can see it here. So I will download for my 2626, okay. And then, yeah, there is a disclaimer, so I agree, of course, and the download starts. Okay, so down, continue. Okay, I can close. So this will update, or I need to refresh, perhaps, yeah. Okay, you can see the latest one I downloaded here. Fine. So now, let me check if all my devices have the latest release. So if I go to Configuration Center here, I can see that, for example, my FAT switch here, which is a 2920, has this release installed on it, and the latest available one in my repository is this one. So it is not the same one, so I can update this one. And also, for my 2626, it is not the, the last one. Okay, so very quick, I can click on Deploy Software. So I selected this switch, I can click on Deploy Software here. Okay, so I can choose primary or secondary. Yeah, let me choose primary. Yeah, I select my software. Okay, latest one, this one. You can see all the other one I have in my repository. Okay. So I select this one. Software check succeeded. Fine. And then I want to yeah, set the current running software as the backup software. And I want also to restart the device after deployment. Fine. So I click on next. Okay. So check sufficient space on my device. So I can click on next. I can schedule it right now. Okay. I click on next again. And I click on finish and this will deploy the software. So we can check which step is running. Okay. Refresh. Okay, so now we have backup of the device software. So first, uh, as I ask for it, I am the backup the current software to the backup software. Okay, so and once it is down, IMC will deploy the 
new software. Now IMC is uh, putting the software we just backup as the backup software in the boot run. Okay, so this will not take so many times. This is it is just a command to send. Okay, let's wait a little bit. And so now the next step is to deploy really the, the, the software. Okay, uploading now. So software is being uploaded. So as far as I know, since I'm connected to this switch, as soon as the software will be deployed, I will be disconnected from the network. So I won't be able to check again on my IMC server where we are. But yeah, I will uh, reconnect uh, once uh, the, the device uh, rebooted. Hey, I'm pretty lucky because I uh, refresh just before the reboot. So I can see the restart device in my IMC window. Okay, so I'm back again. And so if I refresh now, yeah, task is finished. And uh, let me verify all the steps. So initialization, uh, backup the running software, set the backup as the backup software, upload the software, set the new software as the, as the next startup software, and reboot the device. And now if I check in my configuration center, what we can see is that the new software is deployed on the switch. Uh, if you don't trust me, I can eventually connect. Okay, yeah, I don't remember. I think it is this one. Yes. And so if I put a show version, you can see that the cur current software is this one. So the update was successful. Okay, so thank you and see you soon for another session. Cheers, bye-bye.